Welcome to Hatfield's Workout TV, where inspiration meets perspiration. We help people live their dreams. Lately, we have been to lots of schools, leadership conferences, corporate events, and in the next 10 minutes, we'll take you to some of those speeches, and we'll show you a full body workout, full body functional strength workout where you need no equipment. But first, let's take you to Alta Vista Public School where the teachers there are second to none. Check out the enthusiasm. Go work, go hit it, go work, go work. Go work. Unbelievable school and unbelievable faculties. Next we're off to the Senseplex where they have some very progressive, progressive camps going on there. They have hired a very, very intelligent, well-spoken young man, me, to go there and speak about leadership. So check out a piece of that leadership speech. Go see them. Go. And we meet right between those two Super Bowl trophies. Here I am talking to one of the greatest NFL, NFL coaches of all time. And he's surrounded by these Super Bowl trophies. And I went, hey coach, uh, what's going on? Uh, why are you guys here on your day off? And he goes, well, we came in to see if we could find a way to keep you on the team. He wanted to keep me on the team. And I said, coach, that's awesome. I, why? Because I'm so good looking? <laughs> that's a joke. No, he said, Mark, we want you on the team because of your leadership. You see, you don't have to be called captain or coach or star, the guy who scores all the goals, to be a leader. You just have to be willing to go out there and give it your all, try your hardest in front of everybody else and when nobody else is watching. Very nice. Now, we went to a high school called Tugwa High School where over 700 people found something very, very funny. Take a look. Take a look and see if you find it. I got cut. They sent me home. Go home, they said. <laughs> At this point, I left university. I didn't have a home anymore. I had to go live on my mother's green couch. <laughs> I hated that couch. I shared the couch with a weird dog named Fritzy. <laughs> I hated Fritzy. <laughs> My mother would go out. I took the couch, put it in the garbage. She comes home and the lady, you don't throw my things in the garbage. Put it back. I was living on a couch. It smelled like pee and garbage now. I want it off that couch. You can find your motivation anywhere. Okay, anywhere. There's motivation everywhere. Huh, that was funny. Now we are taking the motivational speaking on the road. This stop was in Niagara Falls, Ontario. Big falls, lots of inspiration. Go check that out. And no, I did not wear a barrel at any time during the trip. Unfortunately. All right, I made it here. Uh, as you can see, very inspirational, Niagara Falls. Not sure exactly what it's inspiring me to do, but I think I'll go get a sandwich. See, uh, the room is empty. My speech is over. But I forgot to turn the camera on, so there's no video footage of this. We're just going to go to some comments from some wonderful people who are here. I really liked Mark, ha Mark Hatfield because he was really animated and really got the whole audience involved and really gave a good message of um, really striving to achieve your goals. You made it really fun for everyone. Great stories. It really helped me uh, see what, how I need to work hard to get to what I want to do. You should come to our school. Yeah. I thought it was funny, yeah, except for the sad parts, of course. Yeah. Uh. All right, enough talk. Now it's time to check out a full body strengthening exercise with, like I said, no equipment. Check out this group of young people showing everything they got at Hatfields. Rawr. Or rawr. Ah, welcome to Hatfields Workout TV. Today we're going to be doing a full body strengthening exercise called an Iron Man. I invented that name. It's very tricky, very clever. Today, join us as usual is the Sting Pee Wee Double A. They are a 
experts at this. They've done it a lot. This we can do at the end of our warm up, right before we start doing our drills. Looks like this. Everybody stand up. Hands down. Walk yourself out into plank position. Hold yourself there. Okay, we're going to be doing this for one and a half minutes. Here we go. Down on your elbows. Down on your elbows. Up on your hands. Down on your elbows. Look at the guns. The large biceps bulging. Not true. Not happening yet. I love this part. Back up on your hands. Down on your elbows. Nice. Straight back. Bum up. Up on your hands. Up on your hands. Take your right hand. Lift it off the ground. Point it at the ceiling. Point it at the ceiling. Point it at the ceiling. Point it down. Take your left hand off the ground. Point it at the ceiling. Hold yourself. Nice, strong. It's been 40 seconds. Put your hands down. Take your right hand off the ground. Take your left foot off the ground at the same time. Nice, straight body. Very good. Hold it there. Hold it there. Hold it there. Very good. Hold it. That's been one minute. Put your hand and your foot down. Hold yourself there. Nice and strong. Feel the pain. Love the pain. Embrace the pain. Left hand off the ground. Left hand off the ground. Right foot off the ground. Left foot off the ground. Hold it there. That's 120. You have 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Hold it. Foot down. Hands down. On your elbows. On your hands. Elbows. Hands. Elbows. Very nice. You've got an extra 10 seconds up in your hands. Work yourself back up. Very good. You can do that once, twice a week. Full body strengthening. Ah! Pretty cool stuff. All right, our time is up here. If you have any places that you would like us to go and see. We're going to start checking out local workouts and talking to some people about what motivates them. So give me an email at mark at hotfields.ca or Facebook me, follow me on Twitter, do whatever you got to do, just don't stalk me. But once again, people who you would like to see interviewed to find out what motivates them and some workouts around town, gyms, hockey camps, football camps, any kind of camps... Except for maybe band camp. Hmm. Let me know what you're interested in. From now till then, stay fit, stay lean, and stay mean.